Yeah. Share Ooh. a story. Anybody? Anybody? Well, when people ask me my most embarrassing story, my mind always goes blank. And I think it's because I just try to steer clear of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I will like, avoid all like, I try not to do that. that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but what I will say is that I, my, mis my roommate was Miss Australia, mm -hmm. Rachel Finch, and I loved her so much. For the first time in my life, I felt like I met like my, like a kindred spirit. Yeah. yeah. It's like she felt like me in another body from another country. So it was just cool to be able to live with her for four weeks. Yeah. Um, and we never got in a fight. We were like each other's yeah. buddy and yeah. cheerleader. Yes. Um, and then we were at the Atlantis Resort in the Bahamas. So I got really lucky because the food yeah. was amazing. That's amazing. Uh, mm -hmm. I didn't have to worry about like, food poisoning or anything like that. <laughs> yeah. Right. But then I also gained like five pounds. So well, it didn't look like it. So you're okay. <laughs> yeah, I wish I That's, could redo that. So yeah, like, yo, there's no time to work out at Miss Universe or yeah. before Miss Universe or before Miss Universe if you're Miss USA. Yeah, because it's they so hard. Don't really give you time off because it's a job. You're working. That's your what you're paid for. Yeah, that was actually okay. I know we're switching subjects. We'll come back to yeah. the story. <laughs> But that was like one of my things was yeah. I literally like turned down events so that I could like events that were just for fun so right, that I right. could work out and eat healthy because I didn't want to go to a basketball game or be eating a hot dog. And it paid yeah. off. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah you there. looked your first year. You guys yeah. are really Hello. sweet. Thank you. You're mm -hmm. I preferred myself at Miss USA versus Miss Universe. Me too. I did as well. Also, hair and makeup at mm. Miss USA was like my dream. And I remember yes. Lou, who is like the runway coach, mm -hmm. she would say, girls, like, know who's doing your makeup and like yep. pick mm -hmm. your lip color yep. because it's not about like what they want you to look like. Every girl that wins Miss USA feels beautiful. Mm -hmm. And I yeah. felt beautiful, <laughs> not to be like no. too cocky, but I, mean, I felt yeah. beautiful when I won and I love those pictures. And at Miss Universe, like, I don't know if it was just an off day or if I just didn't feel mm -hmm. confident, but I just like personally, I didn't, I wasn't obsessed with how I felt my hair and makeup mm -hmm. came out that day. Like, right. it was just, different day I just felt, yeah, yeah, I just felt a little, a little off. off. Yep. And I do think that that weighs into it because the whole it time does. I just felt like, does. oh, like, it, I, it just was weird. Because they look really emanated you. Me. And it so looks like you me. were able to shine because you could tell yeah. you were very comfortable yeah. in your whole look. Mm -hmm. Totally. The pink lips and the yeah. pink gown. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, you were able to so you. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I still feel like you were sparkling on stage at Miss oh, Universe. Oh, no, yeah. And not to say, like, I know that it, it all I mean, came together. We just, all like, did well. The, the crazy thing in my head. You right. know, yeah. When you, just how you want to look. Oh, totally. Yeah. And I yeah. felt the same way. I, if I could pick Miss Universe, would have competed with my prelims, everything, hair, makeup, oh, really? earrings, Me the too. whole thing. Me too. Prelims, I am obsessed versus, I don't even like to look at pictures on final night versus what? prelims. No, like versus if prelims. I, if yeah. I'm putting them side by side, I'm like, oh, prelims, for sure. That's funny. I mean, it's totally like, because I was watching you at Miss Universe and Nia was so stunning, but it totally yeah. is like, you've got to do what's right for you and like mm -hmm. have the right mm -hmm. hair and makeup and dress Do you have a you. different hair and makeup person on finals night than prelims? No, but yeah. I feel like it just turned out different. Yeah, so it's so weird. Yeah, same person. And it is true, like a lot of different. the other countries, I don't yeah. know if y'all experienced this, but some of them had learned how to do their hair and makeup for competition and they right. refused to let anyone touch them. Which was maybe smart. Yeah. Because yeah. they knew how they to make it exactly what they wanted. wanted it. But I've always been terrible at doing my hair. So Same. I was like, no way, I'm not doing that. Mm -hmm. So I was promised that I was going to have this one hair person yeah. do my hair, but then I didn't get them. Oh, heck no. <sighs> so my hair just, it was not cute. Oh, yeah. It was kind mm -hmm. of a hot mess. It was so at hectic at Miss Universe. I feel like two different people ended up doing my makeup. Mm -hmm. um, like one person started and then it's like, you kind of mm -hmm. have to like go rehearse and then come back. Yeah. So I had like a second person. It just was, it was just it's crazy. Off, but it's, it's honestly like, it's in your head, but unfortunately, whatever's in your head is what you put out. There. Oh yeah, so true. Um, I know we all. You look good. Stuff. You feel good. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Um, but but back to person. stories. I have so many stories. This is therapy. Oh, no. This USA therapy. Oh no. 
cool. Okay, we're running low on minutes, but I can just switch out the memory cards, so we're good. I'll just have to switch out <laughs> once it turns off on me. Okay, oh back to the stories. Okay. Because you want to to get to looking good and feeling good. Feeling good, yeah. In plenty of time to right. also maybe like meditate and pray, and like have your like inner moment. moment. Mm -hmm. So the longer it's taking, the more for me that anxiety was building yeah. on like, it's getting close and like, I haven't I'm not done ready any yet. of my things yet. Oh, yeah. Gosh. yeah, totally. I, remember, I still have nightmares about it sometimes. Like mm -hmm. competing at a pageant and not being ready. Yeah. Ooh, like, yeah. like waiting in the wings, like my hair isn't done. Yeah, <laughs> having yeah. to walk out. Yeah. It's like going to school naked in your dreams. Right. It's like yeah. that same dream I'm like, no, I'm not ready. I don't yeah. have my face on yet. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, do you have that a story? story? Do you have any story? Wait, yes, I have a, so, such a silly story. Okay, there we go. I have okay. such a silly story, but um, at Miss Universe, I had like severe dry mouth. Ooh, have you ever had this? Yeah, yeah. I, I had never, I had never it had it before it? on stage. The entire time on stage, and it was so oh. bad that like my lips couldn't move. So when I no. smiled, I couldn't like bring my lip back down. <laughs> I know that sounds crazy. So I would literally be like, oh my god, it's stuck in this face right now. So like, just work it. <laughs> and then it was like, as soon as I knew a camera was off of me or something, I would do like. And there's so many pictures of me, because they're capturing pictures the whole minute. There's so many pictures of me like, oh my god. <laughs> those in between moments. That but it was so because hilarious. I was trying to like get my mouth to move. But I learned later, Pia actually taught me later, because I was um we were like doing a little QA on like what are the pageant myths? And they talked about Vaseline on teeth. And Pia was like, Yeah, you use it so your lips don't stick to your teeth. And I was like, what? You were like, oh, that's so this why. Really <laughs> I've always thought the Vaseline on teeth was a myth thing, but Me it's too. actually that's like so dry funny. mouth is a symptom of anxiety, and I definitely oh, was nervous. Yeah. And I never had that before, so I didn't know these tips and tricks. And you don't really have time to like get a sip of water. And like I actually was asking everyone every time the cameras were down, I'd be like, please bring me water. But there's nothing you could do. You're on stage. You can't leave. Oh when yeah. you know when like uh, commercial breaks are on, you're still on stage. So mm -hmm. I was just like so uncomfortable. And you know like it's like when your palms are sweaty or like right. It's like the worse you think about it, the worse it gets. Wait, so yep. this was happening to you during the telecast? During telecast. I would have never even known, and yeah. I was in the audience watching oh God, you. Yeah. So you look good. Thank you. That makes me think of my boot pads. So my <laughs> dress didn't have any like yes. lip any in it. Mm. Same. So mm. I had literally like silicone like inserts. Yeah. And on commercial break, I felt like my dress was coming down a little bit. So I would like, and the judges are there. The Their judges, judges are right there all the time. Anywhere. Yeah, yeah. So I would like, the judges can still see yeah, me. Yeah, it doesn't like, really matter that you're on and commercial like, break. And insert, right. still in yeah, and I would like reinsert my like cups yeah. and never saw oh do that. And I was sitting. In I was in there. Oh, yeah, because okay. yeah, yeah. I kept turning We're around. Good. Like the judges are gonna see this. Really let's, smooth. Let's you adjust kind of myself. To, like you, yeah. you can't. You can't hide from the judges. I right? felt like a little bit of a diva when I was like, someone bring me water. No. I know the judges are right there, but like. You need it. Like, so what happened during your questions. final question? Yeah. Oh. So right before final questions, um, luckily I had made a decision because I was wearing like a cape, which I was like my cape. Like, it was cool. Like, I like fun it. Miss Universe idea. Yeah. And so, but I decided during questions, it would be kind of distracting and it did keep my arms down and I wanted to be able, I'm like a hands talker. Oh. Yeah. So Ooh. I didn't want to feel. That is. That's strategic. That's yeah. a good tip. I didn't want to feel too stiff. So I had already decided like long before the pageant that I was going to take the cape off for questions. So thankfully, I think it was Lou or someone had come out because they knew they were going to take the cape. And I was like, I have to have water or I won't be able to speak. Like I was like, my uh, mouth was stuck together. And so someone oh did. Oh my gosh. Someone like ran out moment. with like, yeah. the, you know, the bottles with the straws. And I was like, thank goodness. But still it was, Yeah. I'm I'm a very big believer in destiny and like everything happens for mm -hmm. a reason and it 100% was my destiny to be top three and no further um, and uh, so I'm okay with it but absolutely like at Miss USA when we finished questions and everything I was like that was the best I could have done yeah. and if I don't win I will walk away happy, happy. because mm -hmm. I did my best right. at Miss Universe there were so many just little weird mm -hmm. things that I was in my head the whole competition that I was like Ooh, I could have done better. Oh, my mouth's dry. Oh, this, my hair is doing mm. something weird. Uh, yeah. Like, my makeup, is it, like, the right color on camera? Because it doesn't feel like it when I look in the mirror. And, like, all of those things, I was very in my head and yeah. not in a good place at Miss Universe. Right. Where at Miss USA, I was like, I got this. I'm having fun. Mm -hmm. I'm in the moment. I'm at peace. 
So I don't know. Yeah, looking back, I definitely would have been more prepared and like also just let go. Like those little things yeah. don't matter. You can't really help dry mouth. in my head. I know. Yeah. <laughs> little things that people had no idea. They saw you sparkling on stage and this right. was what was really going yeah. on. <laughs> I was panicking. And I, and I, I want to ask you guys a question. Mm -hmm.